in the paragraph formation questions. The question has five sentences which are randomly arranged. You are required to rearrange them to make a logical paragraph. Take note of this. A paragraph contains introduction, body, and a conclusion. Remember that each paragraph should contain one new point in your overall thought. Then, should also be able to stand on its own and have its own internal structure. The paragraph contains a topic sentence. That has a supporting details and sometimes a concluding sentence. A good topic sentence tells the reader exactly what the rest of the paragraph all about. After the topic sentence, supporting sentences followed. This part of the paragraph is the explanations or examples. That expand on or support the topic sentence. These sentences are often connected by a transition words or phrases. And lastly, the concluding sentence. The sentences that sum up all the ideas presented. It also expresses the same as the topic sentence, but in different words. Now, let's try to answer these questions. Maria reached office at 10 o'clock after sending the money. Maria's parents needed some money. After that, she spent almost half an hour at the post office. So, she went to bank to withdraw some money. However, she had no money with her. Which of the following should come third in the paragraph? The best way to answer is to look for conatives. Example. Moreover. Meanwhile. After that. So that. Although. However. And etc. These connectives are usually not found in the first sentence of a paragraph. Usually it will be in either second, third, fourth, or maybe in the fifth sentence. Then. Try to understand the sequence. So in this problem. Either Roman numeral 1 or 2 will be our first sentence, since there is no connectives at the beginning. But we cannot say that Roman numeral 1 is our first sentence, since Maria already sent the money. In fact, the rest of the sentences tells us that Maria went first to the bank to withdraw some money. So, our first sentence is Roman numeral 2. Next is, to look for a reason in our first sentence. Understand the situation. What do you think will Maria do, since her parents need some money? Yes, you're right. She went to the bank to withdraw some money since her parents needed it. But before that, why did Maria withdraw money from a bank? Maria withdraw some money in the bank, since she had no money with her. So, in this case, Roman numeral 5 will be our second sentence, followed by Roman numeral 4. After Maria got the money with her, what do you think will Maria do next? Yes, you're right. Since Maria's parents needed the money, she will then send it to a courier service. So, after she withdraw some money, she spent her time at the post office. Therefore, Roman numeral 3 will be our fourth sentence. Lastly, Maria went back to her office after sending the money from the post office. Let's go back to the question. Which sentence should come third? The correct answer is Roman numeral 4. Can I ask for your one minute time answering a survey? The survey will help me improve my teaching strategy in our channel. The survey link can be found in the description box below. Thank you so much. And bye for now.